Hello and welcome to a brief overview of the Money Ledger program for one person. Free version for personal use. In this video you'll see how easy it is for a single person to keep track of all their income and expenses with this ledger. Let's take a brief look at the program and enter a few transactions. The screen you're looking at now is a monthly screen. In the top left you can see that it's January and at the bottom you can click on different tabs, one for each month. On the left hand side of the screen is where you enter in your transactions, your income and expense items. On the right hand side of the screen is a summary statement with all the different expense categories and income as well as subtotals for each which are automatically updated as you enter in your transactions. Scrolling down the screen you see a payment type summary showing all the different payment types you're using along with totals for the month and a reconciliation report which you can use when your bank statements come in the mail you can reconcile these transactions with your bank statement and we'll show you that in a minute. The next screen we have is a setup screen and in this screen you set up all the different expense categories that you wish to track. You can set up the year and then copy the program from one year to the next and easily update the year. And You can also list all the different payment types that you use credit cards, bank account numbers and so on. Once you've set up this screen you can simply click the Save button and you're all set to go. And finally there's a year to date screen. In this screen you have our year to date report with all the different categories that you're tracking. You then have four quarterly reports first, second and third, fourth quarter and then when you scroll down it also keeps track of all the different payment type categories and provides you with a summary of that. Okay let's enter a few transactions. 11th of January. It was a check and let's say it's income and it was salary 1560. Okay on the right hand side of the screen you can see that the income was tracked 1560 and that's it. Next transaction. 14th of January we're using Visa and let's say it's an automotive expense and it's gas purchase. $54. On the right hand side of the screen it's tracking as you can see it's tracking that expense as well. And that's it. You just simply go through your receipts and your pay stubs and so on and enter them into this ledger and let the ledger do the math. Scrolling down you can see there's a net total and further down you can see it's accumulating you know how much you're spending with different payment types. You can also see that right now we have two unreconciled entries. So when your bank statement comes in, you simply check in this column the X and for each one that you see in your bank statement, you check it off, done, done, and at the bottom, the reconciliation report is blank. When you go to the year to date screen, you can see that it's summarizing the year to date totals as well as the quarterly totals for you. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the video and that you found it helpful. Thanks for tuning in.